Alright ladies and gentlemen, I'm here on the show and oh man, feel bad for the Royals. Uh, they lose game four here, three to one. They drop this serious, um, three games to one. Yankees move on to the American League Championship Series, Kansas City Royals. Your season's over, finish, done. Uh, I mean, that's, that's tough, man. The um, Yankees... The ball, all these games were really close, man. This whole series uh, was close, but the Yankees just pulled these games out, and they're headed to their 19th uh, American League Championship Series appearance. So, uh, Garrett Cole, I said last night they needed to get a big start from him. Uh, they did. He was phenomenal. Over seven innings of work. Um, Glaber Torres scored a run. He also drove in another. And Luke Weaver notched his third save of this series. Three saves in four games from Luke Weaver. He was excellent. The Yankee bullpen was excellent this series. The offense didn't have to be great. They drove in runs when they needed to. And their pitching uh, held it down. Just an awesome performance by Cole and Stanton. Those, Cole was great tonight. Seven shutout, or seven innings of one-run ball. Stanton, he had a really good series, I thought. Um, but yeah, sorry about uh, the Royals' loss, man. It's it's tough. But who would have expected them to make the ALDS this year? But the Yankees' uh, spot is clinched in the uh, American League Championship uh, Series. They'll either play the Guardians or the Tigers. They'll find out Saturday. But it was a hell of a run for the Kansas City Royals, man. Um... It happens. I mean, if you're a Royals fan, I think you should be proud. Because you turned an 106 loss team last year into an American League Division Series appearance the next season. It feels bigger than, say, making the Championship Series. Yeah, you would have liked to make it, but get some bats and make some noise next season. And, and Yankees fans are trying to troll when the Royals exceeded expectations after losing 106 games um, last year. And, and trying a small market team. I mean, the Yankees, it's not like their offense was that great. It was just their pitching was uh, A-plus in this series. You wish it ended differently, whether you say with the Royals' series win. But from 56 to 106 to game four of this series, yeah, you wish it, you wish it ended differently, but you're satisfied with the season, and you're looking forward to next year. They just didn't get much. Uh, the bats died, felt like a month ago. It was a good run to even get here. Um, you know, sometimes it happens. Well, um... I'm sure Jazz Chisholm will probably troll him like the loser he is. Like he, yeah, you know, like he did something this year. He's probably hit what 150. Bobby Witt didn't do anything, but that's what they—they they just needed more from Bobby Witt in this series, man. Uh, one for four tonight. Just had a really bad series, I thought. Uh, I think he had. He gets in this series, he had about two or three. Just, they didn't get much from him. They didn't get much from Vinny Pasquantino. Just just really most of the offense in general. I think Bobby Wade even watched their celebration. But there was uh, just some bad luck, I thought, with, um, with them as well. Some bad luck. Uh, Isbell had a fly out. There was a home run. In 24 of 30 ballparks, just nothing could go could go right, and it would have been it would have been had the wind not been blowing in, kind of a little bit of bad luck there, but it's just the offense, um, just really wasn't great. The pitching kept a minute throughout this whole series. It's just um, they just need more offense because the pitching did their job. And yeah, Bobby Witt sucked. I mean, saying he sucked isn't slander. It's kind of just the truth in this series. It's okay to be honest about how he played in the postseason. You can also be grateful for his regular season. But yeah, I think he'll I think he'll be fine in the postseason. I mean, it's his first postseason. 
And, uh, yeah, he was off and what mattered most, but he's the only reason they made it this far this season. Him and uh, Salvador Perez. It's just the offense wasn't there. Outside of Tommy Pham, he's the only guy that had multiple hits tonight. Um, thought the bull the pitching done a good job from Michael Walker to the rest of the bullpen. It's just the Yankees, um, eight total hits, three runs, scored one in the first, one in the fifth, one in the sixth. Royals only got they got they got their only run in that sixth inning. But yeah, I'd say deserving uh, for the Yankees. Got game one of the championship series. Even benches cleared during this game, so but yeah, it was a it was a close and competitive series. And the Yankees whole Bullpen didn't allow a single earned run in the ALDS. Like you're never out of a game when the bull when a bullpen is dealing like this, you're never out of a game. Holmes was huge. No, no, Diddy. Um, but he was huge in this series. I thought Clay Holmes didn't give up a single run. Garrett Cole did the job. Went uh, seven innings tonight. And their ALCS bound. And Aaron Judge caught caught the ball <laughs> to to seal it. But yep, yeah, the the underdog New York Yankees beat the um, uh, Kansas City Royals. Probably what Yankees fans will be saying. Uh, they're going to be trolling that small market team over there. Uh, but yeah, Garrett Cole, I'll be honest, not troll. Um, yeah, Garrett Cole was great. Seven innings, six hits, one earned run, no walks, four strikeouts from Garrett Cole. He wanted it. Everybody in the Yankees wanted it to know about it. Out of everybody, I'd say Garrett Cole wanted this the most, and he delivered uh, when they needed it most. Him and Luke Waver. Just the whole bullpen. Like, let, let's go over the statistics, the stat sheet. Um. Clay Holmes goes one inning, no hits, no earned runs, no walks, one strikeout. And, um, like, he's been great, like. You can't say a bad, a bad thing about Clay Holmes, uh, after this series. Could it change in the championship series? Who knows? But, hey, he did his job. You gotta give credit where credit's due. Clay Holmes was great this series. You gotta give him his props here. Because most Yankees games where they've choked and I've recapped them. Kind of gave Clay Holmes a lot of shit, but he's done a really good job in this postseason so far. Uh, Luke Weaver, one inning, no hits, no runs, no walks, two strikeouts. Man, that, they've done a, the, man, the Yankees management such a, such a good decision picking up Luke Weaver. Because he has been excellent. And Luke Weaver had 4.1 shutout innings. And 12 games as a closer um, since September 6th. He's went 15 innings, 6 hits, 1 run, 0 earn, 29 strikeouts. And 29 strikeouts out of 55 batters faced. And the bullpen is series, man. 15.2 innings, 8 hits, 1 run, 0 earn, 4 walks, 15 strikeouts, 51% ground ball rate. Didn't allow any homers and a 148 batting average. Luke Waver, you, <laughs> that's a, just an unlikely bullpen find. And they made it work out. He was one of the MVPs of this series. I'd say Clay, uh, Clay Holmes as well. Garrett Cole was really good. I'd say um, Stanton was one of the MVPs of this series. Just a bunch of contributions uh, this whole series, man. Um, Glaber Torres had a good series. He was two, two for five tonight with an RBI. Soto won for an RBI. Judge won for two, two walks. Finally had a good game. Uh, Wales 0 for 4. Stanton 2 for 3 and walking in RBI. Chisholm 0 for 3 and a walk. Volpe 1 for 4. Verdugo 0 for 4 and a run. Scoring birdie 1 for 3 and a walk. So yeah, the Yankees won this series 3 1. As for the Royals, uh, Michael Waka Waka A A A. 4.2 innings. 6 hits, 200 runs, 1 walk, 2 strikeouts. I mean, he pitched solid. I mean, 4.2 innings. Only giving up those two runs. My, I think Michael Walker did a good job. They just didn't hit tonight. Walker was fine. The bullpen was good. Every game of the series was decided, was, was decided by two runs or less. And the Yankees outscored the Royals 14-12 in the series. And you had a chance in every game. Um, 
Wonka did what he had to, did what he could. Still a great season. They outperformed, went from 56 wins to a, to a division series. Huge offseason coming up. I think you sign a couple of relievers and keep Wonka. The lineup needs to completely revamped, like. Massey, uh, Witt, Massey, uh, Vinny, uh, Salvi, Garcia, and MJ are the only for sure bats. Sure, uh, are the only for sure's back in my opinion. Y'all get some other outfield bats, but I think they'll be fine. Overall, good season. Michael Walker done a good job. Ursake, 1.1 innings. Pitch, two hits, one earned run, one walk, one strikeout. Uh, regardless of what happened, uh, what, um, what happened, I feel good about Zerpa, or, yeah, Zerpa, Long, Bubich, and Ursag in the back of the pen for their, for the next season. But I'm kind of surprised they put him in in the fifth inning there. I think, yeah, it was the fifth inning, kind of surprised. I can't, I don't know. But, but the offense just didn't deliver. Uh, Annual Zerpa, how the fuck you say his name? Angel, Annual. A uh, 1.1 innings pitch, no hits, no runs, no walks, one strikeout. John Schreiber, 0.1 innings pitch, no hits, no runs, two walks, one strikeout. In the same long, 1.1 innings pitch, no hits, no runs, one walk, and no strikeouts. For the offense, Massey, 0 for 4. Witt Jr., 1 for 4. Pasquantino, 1 for 4 in RBI. Had the RBI double. Perez and Yuli Girl were each 0 for 4. Um... Some of the guys that had really done good against the Yankees in the regular season just didn't do good in the postseason with Bobby Witt and um, Perez. Uh, Melinda is 0 for 3. Man, he almost hit a freaking homer. Isabel had a flat that was a homer in, 26, in 24 ballparks, and Melinda has hit one hard that was a homer in 26 ballparks. Like, so close, man. Uh, Tommy Pham was 3 for 3. See, he'd ha he had half of the hits, had three of the six hits tonight. Uh, he came to win tonight, came to play tonight, he came to win it, but the rest of the offense just didn't fall suit. Uh, Isabel 0 for 3 and Garcia, 1 for, Michael Garcia, uh, 1 for 3. It's gonna be, I mean, he's gonna get freaking trolled by Yankees fans tonight. I mean, yeah, there was a play where, um, he slid in, in hard to vault by. Just a weird vibe for a nothing play. But yeah, 3 1 Yankees win. They win the series 3 1. They're going to be heading to the American League Championship Series uh, starting uh, Monday. On a Monday. So, um, yeah. It's going to be a big day in New York, man. Like the Mets and Do Mets versus my Dodgers or Padres in game to the NLCS. The Yankees host game one. Jets host the Bills. It's like, oh my lord. Epic Monday in New York. Yeah, that's all I'm going to say. Leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. Sorry, Royals fans, but I think you should be happy with the season. Um, very impressed with them this year. 56 wins to a division series. So, they just need to get some bats in the offseason. I think they'll be sad. So, yeah, leave a like, comment, subscribe for more. Check some out. Peace.